this year we're actually showcasing our entire portfolio. Uh, that's ranging from our training solutions to our GX certifications. Uh, but this year we also have our cyber ranges and we're hosting several CTFs. And our security awareness portfolio as well. Um, which this year we'll have multiple demos for and, uh, and finally our cyber academies. So how we're helping organizations and governments throughout the Gulf region train that next uh, cyber talent that's coming up the ranks. Uh, JISIC is important for us uh, for two reasons. One, it's to raise our brand awareness and also to position ourselves as that partner to the governments and enterprises in the region. Um, second, it's also it's become a very important event for SANS uh, to get to learn more new people from the entire Gulf region and Africa and surrounding countries. Um, for us this year, it's also to work together with the Cybersecurity Council to have our instructors talk about the various trends and developments in the industry and, and teach on stage so that we're showcasing their thought leadership. There's, there's currently various trends that we're seeing emerge. I mean, there's um, OSINT is quickly developing itself as this new threat vector that's out there. Um, the other ones are supply chain management, um, cloud security, at the same time, uh, offensive operations is definitely still very prevalent and becoming more and more important, which we're also seeing in uh, the development of our curriculum. It's much more focused on um, offensive operations, hacking, pen testing, and developments in that area. Uh, the other areas that we do also see quickly growing and expanding is artificial intelligence, blockchain, uh, machine learning. And as a result, we've also started to develop courses in our portfolio to attend to those trends and, um, and those needs. Well, like I just touched on, cloud security is definitely one we keep on developing. I think in the course of the last three to four years, we went from having just two cloud security focused courses to now almost every single course of SANS will touch on a specific area of cloud, whether it's in ICS or whether it's in offensive operations or, uh, or in digital forensics. Um, and we're also developing more enterprise focused courses because enterprises are starting realize the importance of cybersecurity and you see that position of CISOs improve at the C-level table. I think the thing that we've noticed over the last couple of years with, the, with coming out of COVID, mass layoffs, uh, people starting to have more mental challenges and mental health problems is actually soft skills are starting to become very important within the industry, uh, which are massively underrated. Like communicational skills, being able to present your case to the board, uh, but at the same time, it's also the leadership skills and being empathetic within your team and making sure that everyone's taken care of and heard. Um, so I think that primarily the soft skills really need to have attention and be, be developed over the next couple of years. Cybersecurity skills more in specific, like I've just touched on, I think it's getting to grips with, um, with smart technology, with, um, with Internet of Things, with, um, with blockchain and artificial intelligence. So that's, that's the primary ones that we see becoming very important.